Hey guys, so I'm in Central Park. The question is, are Central Park hot dogs any good? We're gonna rate them today. I'm gonna hit a couple spots. Look how beautiful the city is right behind me, right by the baseball field. Look what I got on today. I got on my, let me see if you could see it, my uh, Mr. Rogers sweater. Yep, it's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. I just uh, buttoned it up, good to go. Jacket, winter jacket. Wearing a blue suit, so I got the blue one on today, but look at what's behind me. Look at that beautiful view. There we go. And then I'm gonna actually hit this hot dog stand right here. I'm gonna get a regular hot dog and then I'm gonna get a hot sausage. I was talking to the guy a little bit and he mentioned uh, he mentioned how the prices are going up with everything and he's right right he was just mentioning a couple things there's Central Park Zoo right in front all right so I'm gonna get uh, let me get a regular hot dog I'm gonna do mustard sauerkraut and onions mustard, sauerkraut, yep and then I'll try the hot sausage next so I'm done with this Awesome, thank you. There we go, here's the money shot. Look at this New York hot dog. Mustard, sauerkraut, onions. All right, I'll try the uh, the uh, hot sausage next. They got these here with the pretzels, cheese pretzel. They got a whole bunch of stuff on the menu, which is awesome. Okay, good. Yeah, everything's Sobret, everything Yes, except the ketchup. <laughs> except the ketchup, gotcha. All right, here it is. The onion, sauerkraut, everything. All right, beautiful Central Park. I'll show you guys Central Park a little bit. That way you can see. Let's try this baby out. Casing's good. This, the uh, the bread's nice and soft. You can tell it's nice and fresh too. So just the beginning of the year you've been here? Like in this location. Usually I work in uh, Battery Park downtown with the Statue of Liberty. But after the pandemic, they close it and now we like now it's coming back it's yeah, all it's one the company? Same company it's the same company yeah but he didn't get it no more over there he oh gotcha no so you guys are just company. rotating he, he's supposed to have over there too i work over there a long time i work mm -hmm. like eight years only in that one but after the pandemic it's like no more business yeah 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 thank you same thing uh, mustard sauerkraut and onions please sure, no problem. You're seeing a lot more tourists now, or not too much? Not that much. No, not like before. No. But more, more now than during the pandemic. You're seeing more. The pandemic was close. Yeah. We were like nobody was working. Yeah. Last year we like they start to put like in the beginning of the May. They start putting up more people coming in. Yeah, in the May was a lot of people coming, but now. Ah, it's a big sausage, man. Look at that. Sabret also? Yes. All of it? Oh. I got only the ketchup is now sabret. Everything else is from sabret. Everything else is sabret. All right. Let's try this baby out. Pretty good sausage. Wow, it's so spicy. He said it's a bread. It's spicy, but um, you saw prices four fifty, three fifty. Not bad. The hot dog itself, it's good. I'd give it like an eight, right? The bread soft. The the onion sauce is what? Eh, the sauerkraut ham. The hot dog itself is really good. The city right behind the park. I've always loved that. Eight point two. Eight point two. The hot dog itself. Mm. 
I'd give it the same rating, 8.2. Not the best, the best, but it's still, you know, pretty good. Oof, the hot sausage was spicy. It was good though. All right, so here we're we're by the playground. I don't know if you guys could see the playground right in the back over there. And lift it up a little bit. And there's a baseball field. There's, we're still close to the 57th Street entrance. Just want to show you guys. Nice cold day today, so let's try out this guy and see how good it is. Yeah, let me get a uh, regular hot dog, this mustard. Is regular hot dog. Yeah. This is the New York style mustard, Delhi mustard. Okay. There you go. And you like any topping? No, uh, sauerkraut and onions. Yes. This is the cooked uh, cabbage, sauerkraut. Oh, okay, good. And this is cooked onion. All right, there we go. You like tomato ketchup? No, no, no ketchup, I'm good. That's it. There we go, the money shot. Look at this. Pretty good. A lot of nice deli mustard on there. All right, let's take a bite and see how good it is. All right, here we go. I don't know, the onion sauce didn't look too good. He put a ton of that deli mustard sauce, which is okay, I like. Look at that. It looks pretty good. The hot dog looks cooked well enough. <laughs> I had more faith in the other one. All right, let's take a bite of this one and see. Mm. Really, really good. Really, really good. And as you can see, the prices are three fifty, which isn't that bad. It's not bad at all. This is really good. Don't let the looks fool you. The onion sauce is good. The mustard's really good. And the hot dog, great snap to it. This one I rate a little bit high. The, the, the hot dog has more snap and freshness than the first one that I tried. I would give this one uh, an 8.5, 8.6. Really good. All right, just giving you one more view of this. Super beautiful. Love it. You could walk around in the parking and be so close to, to the buildings in New York City. So I'm going to try that hot dog stand over there if you guys could see it all the way down there. So I made my way up the west side. We found one cart. Now I'm going back to the east side. So again, this is all between 57th and I would say 60th Street. The hot dog carts that are between 57th and 60th. So let's try this guy out. And then... Uh, We'll see. We'll get a rating. Hot dog with uh, mustard, sauerkraut, and onions. All right, great. Thank you, man. Enjoy. Have a good day. You too. All right. So this is something you guys got to be very careful, right, and aware. I don't know if you guys noticed it. Maybe if you hit replay, you might see it. But here it is. Ready for this? That's not good. That's not good. Days old bread. Just keeps it in there. Car didn't look too clean. Oh man, I really wanted to rate this, all three of them. So I'm not eating this because this definitely will uh, get you sick. 
this will get you sick. All of a sudden you're, there's an evacuation in your stomach, everybody out, and I don't want that. So how would I rate today? Well, the first hot dog stand was pretty good. The second one I liked a little bit better. Uh, so I would rate 8.5, 8.2, and then this third one is uh, stay away from that one, okay? So I like making the, these videos because it helps out a lot. You could actually see uh, which carts are clean. They're not all the same and, and which, which guys take pride in their work, right? He has to check. He has to check this out. You have to, you know when your bread is old, right? If it's been hanging in there, you got to throw it out. You can't just keep it. So if this is the bread, imagine what the hot dog is. The, the, um, the onions didn't look too good either. I mean, this thing is, this will get you sick. This will definitely get you sick. Look what color that is. That's not brown. That's not brown. It looks like I'm touching the finger of the Crypt Keeper. Look at that thing. No way, man. No way. I'm staying away from that. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much. And uh, have fun. Bye. All right, hot dog break. I'm gonna get these beautiful creatures. Man, these are big. Let's see if I could zoom in a little bit. I don't wanna zoom in too much. Maybe we could keep the quality. But look how big these guys are. Look at these beautiful creatures. That's amazing. Right here, right in the city. Amazing.